Hi guys, Yuri here again. Today I'm going to open the poster collection box from Pokemon 151. Uh, and this is going to be a small opening because there's only three booster packs in it. Uh, it's more so for the promo cards, basically, uh, that are in it and for the poster. I mean, I actually, <laughs> by accident, I already have this poster because in one of the, um, the deliveries that I've gotten... Uh, in one of the packages, uh, there was a poster. They put a poster in, like on top of the of the product, so that so when you uh, cut open the box, you don't cut into the uh, into the products that you ordered. Uh, so they put that poster on top of it, basically as a protection layer, let's say. So I already have this poster. I actually uh, put it up. On my wall right here let me just i can perhaps show you if i just clip this off i'll put it back right away but you can kind of see it whoops right over here and but you only see this side right now there's actually another side of the of the poster that we're gonna see uh in this video as well not fully because like it's too big to to fit it all in the in the in the frame here but okay let's let's open this box this collection box right now we have the three promo promo cards from Bulbasaur Charmander and Squirtle okay, it's quite tough to open this one actually I don't know why I'm using my fingers because in previous openings I actually used my knife and it was actually pretty easy to open it that way. But I mean, it doesn't matter. I already started, so. Okay, so let's take a look at this poster before we open the packs. Let's see here. So. You have the like silhouettes from the all the Pokemon right here, uh, and I think it's kind of their main color that is used as one color for the whole design. Because like, for example, uh, although like Beedrill, I would say is that more? Ah, uh, maybe, maybe more yellow. Uh, like Charizard, Charizard for example is mainly orange, so it's an orange silhouette but then the other side actually contains the the set and not the full set though it's like the all the cards from the set except for the secret rare ones as far as, far as I've seen um, so yeah that's kind of nice uh, I only need one of course but let's Take a look at the promo cards in here. And of course the starters of first generation always have some value to it. Let's take the cards out. All right. Let's put them right here first and let's grab the promo code card the code card steadily okay so we have the code card right here if you want to focus yes and we have the three promo cards oh that was not supposed to happen okay easily carefully so we have We have Bulbasaur, and I really like that in Scarlet and Violet they have the silver borders. Not just because it's a color, but they also use it for holographic patterns, which they didn't with the... Oh, it was not in focus. That's better. Uh, which they didn't in the yellow border cards. They did not make the yellow borders hollow. And I like that they've done this with, the, with these sets. So let's put a sleeve on these promo cards. Let's take a look at the back actually. Looks pretty okay. A small white spot on the left bottom corner. But 
that's basically it. And we have the Charmander. Also looks really nice. That pattern is just so sparkly. Center-wise, it looks great actually too. Let's let's see. Let's take a look at the Bulbasaur again. This one is a little bit top-heavy, but the Charmander is basically perfectly centered, as far as I can see. And I don't know if there's like I don't see anything like print lines. As far as I can see, at least, I mean, looks pretty okay from the back, although not perfect. A little bit right-sided, but still good card, I think. Okay, and then last but not least, Squirtle. Center-wise, a bit top-heavy, I would say, a little bit. Not too much, but just slightly. I don't see anything suspicious on the pattern, but on the back we have a little white spot on the bottom right. And a little bit on the top right, I don't know. Not too much. Okay, cool. I also, I have another one of these uh, poster collection boxes uh, that I will not open, of course. But. And then we have the three booster packs from 151. Definitely one of my favorite sets that I've opened so far. I think Crown Zenith, I think Crown Zenith might beat the excitement of opening. <clears throat> the packs uh, but I mean for nostalgia I think 151 has it definitely all right let's open these packs let's start with this one I was thinking what I was about to open in the next uh, video and I think I might open the Arceus uh, ultra premium collection box over there um, seems really exciting to to open that because there are a couple of metal cards in that as well um, and there's not a lot of metal cards in general so so this is it's none from the back because um, we can have one of these uh, what do you call it um, these uh, hollow or reverse hollow uh, energy cards. We have Venonat, Pidgey, Metapod, Ponyta. Oh, by the way, I, I'm still waiting actually to buy the binder collection box from 151 so that I can um, put all the different cards in it and see how many cards that I already pulled and how many that I don't, uh, that I haven't pulled yet. So we have Kadabra. Ivysaur, Slowbro, Nidorino, a Reverse Hollow Gengar, which I already have, a Hollow Mr. Mime, which I already have. All right, all right. So, and um, the Holographic uh, Steel Energy. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Let's sleeve both of these. All right. <clears throat> moderate beginning I would say uh, no new pulls as far as the rare slots uh, regarding the, the, the rare slots of the of the pack at least I don't know about the regular pulls uh, I don't know on the top of my head all of the cards that I have pulled from 151 and the ones that I haven't. Uh, so we have the code card right here, pack two, second from last, only three packs, pretty quick opening. Oh, no, 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 don't take anyone, any from the back. We have a Shelder, Antique Helix Fossil, Slowpoke, a Magmar, 
muck, daisy's help, a venomoth, a reverse hollow horsey, a reverse hollow nidorina, and a hollow articuno. Okay. Not crazy. Not crazy. All right. Oh, and then we have a basic energy, of course. Well, I think I missed... Wait, did I miss a reverse hollow in the last pack? I think I did. I think I did. Um, reverse hollow Gengar. Oh, no, I did not. Wait, that's kind of strange, actually, because... There was like... Was there, was there a card missing? Wait, that, that's kind of weird, actually. So, in total, I should have pulled 20 cards right now, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 20. Oh, there's 11 cards in it. Well, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. Last pack here. Of course, if you, op if you only open three packs, what can you actually expect, right? There's a good chance we'll not have anything, because this is the last pack. Oh, come on. All right. We have Tentacle, Rattata, Squirtle. Oh, it's not focusing. Sorry. Fo Squirtle. We have Lickitung, Pidgeot, Ammonite, Tauros, Reverse Hollow Persian. I don't know if I have this one. Reverse Hollow Execute, <laughs> and a Hollow Ditto, and a regular Basic Energy. Well, that was the least. Um, Exciting 151 opening that I've ever had so far. Definitely. <laughs> hey, but what can you expect, right? Three booster packs. Um, yeah, nothing special here. And I just, I just leave the regular hollows as well, just to preserve those cards. Um, but yeah, that was a very anticlimactic. Um, Opening. <laughs> 151 has been really good to me, uh, but today is a day off, probably, so. Not bad, not bad. I don't know if I have the ditto yet. I think so, yeah. I think I have the ditto once. Uh, but okay, guys, uh, I hope you kind of enjoyed it um, and look forward to the next opening because next opening will be more exciting, I think. The Arches. Uh, Arceus, Arceus, whatever, um, Ultra Premium Collection box um, has some really nice stuff in it, I think. So, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share the video. Also, don't forget to check out some of my other openings on the channel. Um, and yeah, th thank you so much. I appreciate all the support on the channel. Um, and see you guys next time. Thanks so much. Bye.